Hello guys, happy new year. Welcome back to the channel. And um, today we're just gonna take you guys out for a little bit on track and do a little bit of racing showdown. And um, I'm just trying to get back into the game. Um, it worked out perfect for me because I have a Ford that I've been working on for a long time. The tune is not yet perfected, but you know, I'm still working on it because I wanna bring this tune to you guys. I'm actually hoping to get my very first world record with this tune here. Um, there was actually another car, a Dodge, that I was working on also. And what we'll, we'll see how it go. I'll figure one thing at a time, right? All right, so we're out here on track. We are in LA, they say. And uh, so we're on the streets of LA in front of the arena here. And um, so we're looking around for some challengers. I think I'm gonna get challenged right now. Yeah, there we go. And uh, so I was just checking that car out. I wasn't checking out the girl. I was checking the car out to see if um, if it was something I want to race with, um, because there is the um, the Ford Cobra Jet, which is like S class, and that's a killer. That that car we definitely can't even go up again. So most times I won't even race that car, even with boost. I won't even bother racing that car. That car takes down R class cars all day. All right, so here um, we get challenged by a Mustang, and I believe this Mustang is B class, but apparently um, it tunes up to 1662, which is pretty high for a B class car. B class car averages tunes up to about 1658. So here we're crossing the line. Here we're going to check it. Here we're going to check our time, and we're going to check the um, the tune on on the car. So let's verify. Yep, see, it is a B class 1662. And um, we did, we're doing okay, pretty pretty good on our time there. Sorry for the um, the blurriness of the video, but I'm not gonna let anything stop me from bringing videos for you guys. I'm just gonna keep on trucking. I am recording in 780p, which is the highest standard for my um, for my recording to, uh, available to me. Um, you know, but I'm just gonna keep on trucking, keep on trying to push out videos for you guys. Um, you know, no more delays. Um, that time we just ran 8.5 is pretty close. We're about a, a hundredth of a second behind the world record. And you're going to see we're, we're going to even do a, a better time, I think, coming up in this um, the next race we do here. So we are going to challenge this. It was a Shelby uh, 500 GT or GT 500 Coupe, as it says on screen here. And I think they are going to accept eventually, you know, <laughs> um, yeah, but um. And I was, and but I was, I was mentioning the world record. So we're trying to do a world record. I'm trying to bring this tune to you. The world record for this car is 8.44, if I'm not mistaken. So, so far, I think I've hit 8.45, which is very good. Car is ready to be pinked. It's a, it's a good tune, but I'm finding that I could still sneak parts on the car. And um. Basically, what I, what I mean by that, or let's let's look at this recap real quick first before I continue. All right, so he was the um, he Sergio, so he was under two in 1661, um, and we did a four eight point four seven seven. So we're not that far from the world record. Okay, so what I mean by sneaking parts is because the car says 1663, it doesn't mean it's at its maximum potential. So you so you guys have to be careful of this. If you guys are new to the game, the veterans should know what I'm talking about. If you're new to the game, say you're tuning a car, okay, we're working on 1663 because that's right in front of us right now. Um, See, so you, you work, you're tuning a car to 1663. Now this is a Cobra here and I was considering, I'm going to take a long time before I accept this race because I was, this is the first time I'm seeing this car, a 2013 Ford Mustang Cobra Class WL. I'm not sure what that means, and I haven't seen it before, so I was considering: is it um is it a jet? I wasn't sure. I almost didn't take the race, but I said, let me go ahead and try them out and take it, and it was a very close race. You guys check it. Out. Okay, so I'll pull away for a little bit here. We're gonna see who rally back a little bit and come back on me. Yeah, so it's pretty close. Right, so what I mean by sneaking parts is, we are sixteen sixty three. You can see from my tune there, and he's an S class sixteen sixty three. 
So the car will say 1663, but it might still be able to take parts or even take weight reduction on car on the car sometimes. So you guys have to be very careful of that. Uh, for example, I tuned a 1650 Corvette the other day, and I don't think I, t I, I didn't wait until I tuned it to its maximum potential. I went out on track. There was a guy out there. He was in a M6 BMW, and he wanted to pink. And I was like, I'm doing pretty good. I'm running the car pretty well. I think I could take this guy. But the guy, he ran even better than I did. And funny enough, uh, I went back on track. I had another 1650 car. It was a 1650 Lobby. I don't, I don't remember if it was a showdown or what. I was just watching a replay there. That was the same car we raced against, but he raced a non-boost here at 8.7. Um, anyways, so I went back on track, and I noticed that he pinked another guy, and he won the first race, another Corvette. He took another Corvette. But the guy came back with another Corvette and eventually took his car. But the, and I saw the replay very, very close. So that dude was doing it in his M6. You know, so um, guys want to be. Anyway, so that's that's for another time. All right, so I, I challenge. I think I eventually get a race with this guy too. He eventually challenges me again, and I do accept. Um, yeah. So me personally, people don't like when you're boosting for on free races but anything over 1650 for the most part people are boosting you so that's why i do it i don't i don't want to be here losing races breaking a car and everybody else is boosting me and i you know i have tons of boosts anyways um i've really been slacking on showdown and on um and on turf turf war so i I have tons of boosts saved up. I'm not going to accept the race right now. I'm going to actually race them later. You're going to see in Showdown and in Turf Wars, if you race players too often, they they get they give you point reduction anyway. So that's I wasn't disrespecting Sergio. It's just that if you race too close um, back to back, you 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 don't get as much points anyways. And I figured there was a quite a few cars in the lobbies that I wanted to challenge anyways, and. Um, but the last race we're going to do here on track is actually with Sergio. You know, so, um, you know, it's a new year. Um, I want to wish you guys Happy New Year. You know, I want to thank all the people that still hang out with me. I want to thank all the new subscribers. And, um, you know, I know right now is a bad time for the channel because, uh, because I, I am over there on, you know, doing other things, basically. Um, you know, uh, uh, trying to, trying to, it's, it's in... For the benefit of the channel, um, believe me, what I am doing. It's for the benefit of the channel. Look at these perfect launches I'm getting. I hope I only hope when it comes time for me to pink the car, I'm hitting these perfect launches and I'm not bumming the launches and I'm not fouling the races. So but um but I am still working on the two anyway. So you know I'm just trying to bring you guys videos. Here goes a four point eight point four six. So that was pretty close to the record also. Yeah, um, you know, but um so I'm trying to just bring you guys videos as much as possible you know i am still doing what i'm doing over there on the other game uh war robots however you know i i want to keep the channel alive i, I find that i've been doing a lot more live streaming lately check the link in the description of this video here you'll find the link to my live stream channel which i decided to keep live stream separate from my regular videos just because it's a different type of atmosphere when i do live streams you know you get a lot of trolls and it just it's like a lot different i'm a lot calmer I, i'm used to this person being your youtuber being your video creator you know i'm just being nice and calm and, and making cool videos for you guys and it gets live stream you know it really brings the worst out of you sometimes the, the people you come across you know and i am by no means a pushover so i don't like when people try to show up in the live stream and, and try to um, you know take advantage of this nice guy that you you see here making videos for you guys so it, you know it gets rough sometimes so you know this arrivals daily um i'm not sure where it's gonna go but you know, um, basically, I just want to bring you guys news, anything I could do, quick, short, 10-minute videos. You know, I just want to pop them out for you and, um, you know, just get them out to you guys and, and, you know, and give you something to watch. There's, you know, <laughs> nothing going on on YouTube, pretty much. Um, speaking speaking about YouTube, guys, if, uh, if there are video creators out there that I have not subscribed to yet, please let me know in the comment section that hey um hey jack hey jack you know i, I hope you guys subscribe to me also 
But hey, Jack, you know, subscribe to my channel. Come check my channel out. Come watch my videos because I like to watch videos on YouTube, guys. And, and this that's a big part of why I decided to do Rivals Daily. So I think we're going to actually break the car here. And we think we're going to be ending the video pretty shortly. So I just want to remind you guys also. Okay, let me finish this up. So let me know if you guys create videos you know, let me know. Tell me, Jack, look, come check my channel out. Please subscribe. I will definitely check your channel out. I'll subscribe to you. I'll even shut you guys out. All right. Um, if you're making good videos. All right. So, uh, so make videos for me so I could have something to watch. I want to make videos for you guys so you guys could have something to watch because a video is different from a live stream. And, you know, and um, so much different atmosphere, a little bit more polished than whatnot. Anyways, guys. Check the link in the description. Find me over there on Facebook for trading, racing rivals, middleman. Um, you guys be blessed. You know, I hope you're having a great new year. I hope you guys have everybody's making resolutions for the new year and everything. All right. So I will catch you guys in the next one, man. I appreciate you guys so so much for hanging with me, for riding with me. And um, let's just keep it rolling for 20, 2018. Let's make this the best year ever. All right. Okay, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. You, you be blessed and bye-bye.